hey guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new it's your girl ashton alun say it's your girl who bitch is ashton alun period so as y'all see from today's title we will be turning this pink blow up couch into my new vanity area i bought this vanity for myself as a christmas present because i've always wanted a vanity that's the whole point of me getting that mirror right there so i'm gonna be putting my vanity up today but without further ado let's get right into the video so here we have one second a second this shit is heavy as fuck <sighs> here we have our new vanity that's gonna be in the space that my couch is in. I'm trying to stall on deflating my freaking couch because I can't believe like this is the last day I'm gonna be having this couch. I need to process that. I already took my last set of pictures in my mirror. If y'all don't follow me on Instagram, make sure y'all follow me. It will be at the bottom of the screen and in the description box. If you go on my page, you'll see like I have majority of my mirror pictures. My couch is in the back and it just goes with the aesthetic, my outfits. Everything just ties together and I'm just like, I'm not going to be an accessory in my photos anymore. <laughs> but I think I want to make a TikTok for my last day having my blow up couch. So I am back from making my TikTok. I send my condolences. I made my TikTok. I did my last set of photos with my couch, my iconic blow up couch. And now it's time to let her go. I'm gonna start by taking all the pillows off. Oh my God, wait, <sighs> no. Like what? She's leaving? She's so iconic, I don't wanna let her go. I'm wasting time, so let's just Let's just let her go. Sometimes you have to just rip the bandaid off. I think that's what I'm gonna do because if not, I'll be sitting here all day reminiscing. Here's one air hole. Here's another air hole. The third air hole is right here. No! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I, I can't do it. Can I do it? <sighs> Am I being dramatic right now? Okay, I'm just gonna do it. Fuck it. Y'all, it's literally deflating. She will be missed. It's okay. I'm, I'm gonna blow her back up and I'm gonna be happy again. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. While she's over there in the corner deflating, I am about to bring that big, huge, heavy box. Ooh. I'm over here about to bust out on the sweat. This shit is heavy, for real. Okay, I'm just gonna take everything out the box. So I don't know what these are for. There's a lot of pieces like this. My room is about to be messy as here is the guy that I was looking for. So here's where you scan it at so you can see the stuff. Oh, now I have to download an app. Oh, they fancy. Okay. This comes with a pamphlet that you have to download the app for and they give you 3D instructions. In the app, they literally show you like all of their products. You just choose the one that you order. So I got the five drawer desk. This is what it looks like. It says it takes two hours and 30 minutes to put together and you need two people. But me, I'm an independent black queen, so I don't need no one. I'm gonna need a wrench, a hammer, a screwdriver, a tape measure. Oh, baby. Oh, oh. So we back, and I have all the tools that I need. Got my screwdriver with the drill, of course, because who is doing manual work? We got a hammer, tape measure, and then it came with a wrench. Now we can get started, period. Yay, it started. Okay, I got all these tools. Oh, Miles, it said don't use a drill. Probably because they don't want you to drill it oh, too yeah, hard. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, my bad. It could crack the zone. I've cracked the zone. It could crack it. We have our screwdriver now. So we need one of our wooden panels and a cam bolt. How many wooden panels are there, though? I'm already lost. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. I'm already kind of lost. So I'm back. I just did my overview on all the pieces that I have. I thought I was missing one. I was about to square up with Amazon. But I checked over again and I actually have all the pieces. Yes! Let's insert two wood dowels into JA. So let me find JA. So here we have JA. So I'm gonna open my toolbox. Obviously, I should have known what a wood dowel is because the first word is literally wood. So I'm gonna take two of these and insert them on each side. They have two little holes. I inserted all of the wooden dowels into these big 
pieces. I'm on step nine and it says insert four cam locks into the backboard. First of all, what even is a cam lock? I love this little app thing because it literally shows you like what each tool is like. This is so convenient. If I didn't have this, I don't know what I would be doing. We have 20 cam locks. It says to insert this into the backboard. I'm thinking like in these little holes right here. So we have all the cam locks in there. Y'all, I'm so happy. It's literally about to come to life and the amount of videos I'm about to be shooting in my room now. So I'm gonna do my hair in my room, my makeup. Shit, I'm gonna do mukbangs in here. Like, bitch, I'm so happy. It says insert six cam bolts and one drawer stop into the desktop. So this is the desktop right here. Okay, you guys. So I just screwed in what they call the cam bolts. Six cam bolts, number three, one, five, one, three, and one drawer stop number nine zero eight zero one into the desktop, desktop. lt, LT. Mm -hmm. next step insert two wood dowels and two cam locks into the left side panel Ooh, i'm not trying to get no splinter have y'all ever had a splinter that shit it's like a paper cup times 10 so it's going on i don't know how long it's been since i started but bitch we get we making progress so i'm on step number 12 and now we attaching the drawer slides so i have 10 of these they slide like this let's listen to what she has to say number four one four zero four pull the outer rail forward mm -hmm, like this orientation of the d-shaped cutout d-shaped cutout okay boom next step next step the second round hole will be used to attach the slide to the panels so she slid it out to make three holes and she's talking about this hole is going to be used to attach it to the panels okay so this is fw left side panel so we found the slide screw blah, 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 blah. it's a very tiny small screw now we're about to attach the drawer onto the desk use my little screwdriver and i'm gonna screw her in period so this is where my drawer is gonna be at i attached the screw right there now i'm about to do it on this side i just finished putting the drawer sliders on this shit took so long for no reason like i literally had to drill two four six eight holes it was the hardest thing ever to do like why wouldn't you already have the holes in there that's just stupid to me so now i'm on step 19 i'm literally almost done not really i'm not really almost done i'm literally not even halfway done <laughs> Okay, so finally I am done with this freaking drill. Hopefully, I think I am because I don't have any more of these little slider things. These things are so freaking annoying. So now we're on step 22. Okay, so now I need these two panels. So then I need shelf 11. So I have all the products. Now I have to attach it to the left panel and the middle panel. And I have to use eight hex screws. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me get myself together because what even is a hex screw? Okay, so this is a hex screw. I'm going to use all eight. It came with eight and I need to use all eight. Okay, this is a little complicated because I can't tell like which panel is which. So this is one panel. Oh, bitch, literally just click on it. You know what? That's my stupid ass fault. I forgot that you could literally do that. So maybe this is the part where I need two people. But unfortunately, I don't have that right now. I'm going to use the wall for my support. One panel, two panels, three panels, and then the shelf. So basically what I need to do is how this has a little piece on the out outside. I'm just going to stick them into these little holes down here. And it's just going to mesh together. Okay, so I have to put it in at the top too, like this. Ah, okay, so it's gonna be, eh. Now I have to click these little sides into these little holes right here. So now we have the drawers situated. I'm about to screw these little screws in and we are gonna be done with the drawers, with the drawers. This is what my drawers are looking like for right now. I'm on step number 24. Almost done, almost done. So this is the backboard. I'm supposed to just attach it right into these. And now we take this little board here and attach this. Hey bitches, so it is day two of me putting my vanity together. 
Last night, I could not do it, y'all. It was getting late and a bitch was tired. I think I left off putting on the backboard to my vanity. I did go ahead and just put my tabletop on. It's not like completely secured down. I wanted to do that with y'all on camera. Let's finish this vanity so we can see the final product. We left off on step 29 and that was supposed to be me attaching the desktop to the unit. That's all I did. So now we're moving on to the actual drawers that's going to go right here. And basically I have to drill these little cam bolts. I have to drill two cam bolts in each drawer. So I just finished making all of my drawers and surprisingly sliding this little cardboard piece in was like the hardest part ever. All of my drawers are done. They have the handles on them. They are secure like bitch. They is not going nowhere. Now we're about to attach the drawers into these little things so basically you just pull them out all of these grooves that are around the drawer you just like make sure to slide them on there I'm about to screw these little screws on there so that it can be secure okay drawer number one done three more to go I'm so happy. So all of my drawers are installed as you can see. Now I'm about to move on to installing my top drawer. And I don't think I'm going to film this part just because this video seems like it's already super long. So I will be back when my vanity is complete. And y'all going to see the final product. I am highly upset, bitch. We have bad news. The biggest mistake you could have ever made while setting up this vanity, I just made. And now I don't think I'm about to have a top drawer. So do y'all see how each this line and this line is at the bottom, but this line is up here. It really should be down here. That means that this little drawer bottom that I have, this drawer bottom can't slide in. So therefore, I'm not able to put this in to have a top drawer. But the type of material rivet that went in there was plastic. So I had to put these two plastic things inside of there so that it could stay matted together but i had to use a hammer kind of hard even when i was like banging the hammer on it like it was hard for it to go in there because it's a little tiny hole and a big little plastic rivet but i don't know how i'm supposed to take this apart so it's like i'm shit out of luck okay y'all so i'm finally done with my vanity you can see in the background just a little bit i'm gonna show y'all in a second but i just want to let y'all know i'm very upset I'm very upset that I don't have my top drawer. I just feel like it's always something. Like, shit can never go good because it's going to always be something. Like, I'm real upset about that. Oh, you guys, this is my new vanity. I put all these drawers together, bitch, by myself. That's my little chair. I tried to make it cute and add, like, a little cheetah print um, pillow. So, I got my little mirror. I got my candle. And this is the little clear compartment thing. Like, yeah y'all this is my little space and this is me so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i love y'all and i'll see y'all in my next video bye bitches